Hello YouTube, this is Man 83 here and we're back today with our next part of our blind playthrough of Mass Effect. In the last episode we had one hell of an episode, we became a Spectre. And uh, then we cleared out all the submissions we picked, the, uh, all the side missions we picked up in the, uh, well, moving around the Citadel. And so now we need to head down to the, um, the Sigsec docking bay to hook up with the uh, ambassador and get uh, things moving because we can now, we've now been given the mission of going after Saren and stopping whatever nefarious plans he has. And if I remember correctly, I think the, um, oh, we don't want the map, we want the journal. Oh yes, we need to get the Alliance docking bay which is accessible through the central elevator in the CZ Academy. Ooh, of course highlighted. That's uh Ooh, we've got two um two buffs. Ah, okay, what was that one then? Oh store discount. Ah I think we need to give our um combat armor a bit of a boost. Well we've maxed out soldier anyway, so we can do get a lot more in the special training as well. Hmm. We're getting buffed up our um can we use that a lot. I'll buff up our assault rifle for now. Oh hello, I forgot we got the area we got our um forgot we got our squad mates to go. Uh so what we're gonna give Garrison, what we're gonna bump him up in. Well so we unlock sniper rifles, it's through assault rifles. Um Ooh, let's buff up his decryption and um, dampening as well to bring those up. Alright, let's uh, do tally then. Well, we've got Gareth for decryption, but I think we need to give her a boost and we'll give her pistols a boost as well. I think that's stuck. Yep, that was stuck. Alright, so, yeah, so we want to go to CSEC Academy. We'll just follow the directions. Oh, to see Second Academy. Yay! That was the awesome Solarian quick. excavation team has run into an unexpected problem after unearthing a Prothean dig site. Hanar protesters have blockaded the dig site, claiming that artifacts of the Enkindlers, as the Hanar call them, should not be disturbed. The excavation team has appealed to Hanar representatives on the Citadel to reach a diplomatic solution. Ooh, sounds like a possible side mission then. Do 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 do. Oh, this will be the. Uh, is this what we need? Oh yeah, the elevator to the docking bay. Ooh, let's have a little look around here because uh, I don't think we explored around here fully. Oh, this is the requisitions officer. We spoke to him. And let's see what's down here. Hello. Oh, elevator to the wards. No, we don't want to go that way. And what's up the stairs here? Sorry, I'm just exploring because uh, I'm being nosy. Ooh, we can't get in that one yet. Decryption skills too low. <laughs> oh, I think this okay. is where we just um. Let me get this straight. Your business partner, Shorman. He's threatened you? Who? Well, no, uh, not exactly. But he wants to meet with me. I think he's going to kill me. And why do you think that? I... I can't really get into the details. But Shorban will kill me if I leave here unprotected. I... Okay, hey let's find out what's going on. Oh, you're not CSEC, are you? Did you want something? Yeah, we have heard you. What were you trying to explain to the officer before? My colleague is trying to kill me. 
And I thought we were friends. Kill you? How do you know he wants you dead? He's changed. He won't talk to me at work anymore, and he started following me. Yesterday, he followed me all the way home, just waiting for a chance. Okay, sounds serious, but I, I think he could be a little bit paranoid. Thinks. He wants me gone. I know it. Eh, how can we help? Is there something I can do? Talk to your friend, maybe? Would you? That's all I want. Someone to talk to him. Tell him to leave me alone. He thinks he can just push me around. But you'll show him, won't you? Yeah, we'll have a little chat with him. Just tell me where he is and I'll go find him. Oh, right. Well, he wanted to meet with me down in the wards near the markets. He said he just wanted to talk, but I know better. His name's Shorban. He's a Salarian. You shouldn't have any trouble. He's just a scientist. I've met some dangerous scientists in my time. Um, I suppose you're right. Well, good luck. Let me know what he says. Okay. Well, lucky enough, we just happen to have a, uh, a way down to the ward, so we'll, um, go and knock this out quick. And then, and, um, and then, uh, continue on. We'll just do this side mission, because it's, uh, see, it's sometimes what happens when you just wander around. Binary Helix has settled out of court with a Krogan group that had accused the Genetics Corporation of fraud. The Krogan group had contracted Binary Helix to perform studies with a long-range goal of curing their genetic sterilization. The group later sued for a return of investment money when the study produced no viable results. Run, run, run. Oh, we hit the wrong. Oh, we hit the wrong one. We didn't want to go to the wars. Oh, oh, dude! I always hit that wrong button. Yeah, that's where we want to go to. Oh uh, dear! This time we just got to. Um, this time we just go this way. We're taking a slightly long way round. Actually, what we should have done was marked it on the map, don't we? we will... Yeah, we just kind of want to go to... That way, because we want to go to the lower wards. So we just run... Well, it's just pretty much a straight line, anyway. Well, we can't go that way, we've got to go around. I suppose we could take the, uh... Is that really... Oh, so we're going to go around. Oh! Ah, there he is. Hey, your man. Wanted to have a little word with you. Hold it right there. Just throw me the data and you can walk away. Hmm, data? What data? What are you talking about? I didn't come out to play games with you, human. I'll ask you one more time. Give me the data and you and Jalid will live to see another day. Mm, let's talk about this. There's no need to let things get out of hand. Fine. Have it your way, boys. Oh, great. Let's have got some folks to deal with. Wait, I give up. I give up. Please don't kill me. <laughs> Convince What's me. What's so important about this data? Why are you trying to get it? I thought you knew. He said you were going to deliver it. He said that? And what exactly was I supposed to be delivering? It's the initial data from scanning the keepers. You see, we stole some research from our work to make the scanners. We were supposed to work together. I get the data, he analyzes it. Okay, so... What's so special about that? The keepers are almost impossible to scan, and you can't capture them or get samples. They just self-destruct, 
After centuries here, we still don't know anything about them. Don't you see? We were the first to scan them, ever. Uh, oh, Angelique. Why are you trying to kill your partner? I'm not trying to kill him. Khalid's job was to disseminate our initial findings. But he decided to keep the data for himself. Maybe to sell it. I don't know. No, oh, great. Let's hope we got in the middle of something big here, then. So you're just trying to get back what Jalid already stole. We lost our heads. We just couldn't let an opportunity like this pass us by. But it doesn't matter now. I just want to live. I don't care if I ever see that data again. All right, let's have a look at the scanner. So how do you gather data on the keepers? It's not difficult, really. Just get within range and scan them. You seem interested. Enough to help me, perhaps? Mm, maybe. How could I help you? I'll give you my scanner. Whenever you see a keeper, scan it. Discreetly. My database will update automatically each time you scan a unique keeper. Then I'll update your account with a few credits. Oh, okay, we'll take the middle route on this one because I think, um, you know, a few extra credits here and there. Okay, yeah, we'll take the middle route. I suppose route. a little scanning here and there won't hurt anyone? Very good. Maybe if you wouldn't mind speaking with Jalid. The data you're gathering for me is useless if Jalid won't help me analyze it. No, I'll course. go have a chat with him right now. Thank you. And happy scanning, Commander. Alright then. So back to the ward to back to CSEC we go then. And what we'll do is Oh we don't go to Oh we'll just take the uh, the rapid transit and get out of here. Well, I want the presidium locations. Uh, hmm. Uh, go back. What's the wall location? See if we can get directly to. Hey, C sec. There we go. That's where we wanted to go. Oh yeah, well that's a nice view. Yay, we arrived at CSEC Academy. Right, yo, we just need to... Yeah, we just need to locate Jalid and have a little chat with him and he's this way. There he is. Want we'll to have a little chat with you, boy? Hello again. Did you have any luck finding Shorbin? Yes, we did. I found out you've been lying to me, Jalid. Lying? Why would I lie to you? You forgot to mention the data about the keeper. Uh, he told you? I didn't mean for any of this to happen. Yes, you did. I was afraid Shorbin would kill me to get the data, so I. Well, I was hoping you'd take care of him. It's okay. I'm scanning the keepers for Shorbin, but you two need to stop fighting. You're... you're helping us? But... well, if you say so. Well, if Shorbin can forgive and forget, then so can I. I appreciate the help, Commander. I better go get that data analyzed. Hey, looks like we've had a good old boost. Alright then, well, that's that one done. Ooh, let's have a look at the journal. Yes, yeah, we've got to scan the keepers. Um, let's hope we get to scan 20 of them. Oh, well, we're not going to go scan the keepers all now. We're going to just have a look at the map, because we want to... Oh, that's right, yeah, we want to get to the, um... We want to get here to the docking bay and continue the story on. Do we need... I think we're going the right way. Yes, we are. 
a elevator to Ducky Me. Chairman Burns of the Parliament Subcommittee on Transhuman Studies has been kidnapped by biotic extremists. Ooh, that's not fun. The biotics commandeered a freighter and were last seen in the Hades Gamma Cluster. No demands have yet been made. I wonder if we're on if we'll pick that up. Yep, we have because the journal's just updated. I think. In Hades Gamma Cluster, I think we um had Unearthly Orc in Heater Cluster. No, we've got loads of different ones. There we go, let's talk to yeah, the ambassador wants to see us, so let's get chatting. I've got big news for you, Shepard. Captain Anderson is stepping down as commanding officer of the Normandy. The ship is yours now. Hey, we've got a ship. She's quick and quiet, and you know the crew. Perfect ship for a Spectre. Treat her well, Commander. Oh, we will. I'll take good care of her, sir. I know you will, Commander. Yeah, what are we doing I this? I want the truth. Why are you stepping down, sir? You needed your own ship. A Spectre can't answer to anyone but the Council. And it's time for me to step down. Yeah, there's more Come to this. Come clean with me, Captain. You owe me that much. I was in your shoes 20 years ago, Shepard. They were considering me for the Spectres. Who? Why didn't you ever mention this? Yeah. What was I supposed to say? I could have been a Spectre, but I blew it? I failed, Commander. It's not something I'm proud of. Ask me later and I'll tell you the whole story. For now, all you need to know is, I was sent on a mission with Saren, and he made sure the Council rejected me. I had my shot. It came and went. Now you have a chance to make up for my mistakes. No, Saren probably set the bar so high you can never jump over it, and so therefore you were doomed to fail because he just never wanted you in there. I won't let you down, sir. Saren's gone. Don't even try to find him. But we know what he's after. The conduit. He's got his Geth scouring the traverse looking for clues. We had reports of Geth in the Ferro system shortly before our colony there dropped out of contact. And there have been sightings around Noveria. Find out what Saren was after on Pharos and Noveria. Maybe you can figure out where the conduit is before he does. And what about the Reapers? The Reapers are the real threat. I'm with the Council on this one, Shepard. I'm not sure they even exist. But if they do exist, the conduit's the key to bringing them back. Stop Saren from getting the conduit, and we stop the Reapers from returning. Mm, good plan. You know. Stop the invasion before it even happens. So if you're not sure if they exist or not, then if the only way to make them exist is get the conduit, then if we control the conduit, Sam can't bring them back. Boom. So let's go. I'll stop it. We have one more lead. Matriarch Benezia, the other voice in that recording. She has a daughter, a scientist who specializes in the Protheans. We don't know if she's involved, but it might be a good idea to try and find her. See what she knows. Her name's Liara, Dr. Liara Tassoni. We have reports she was exploring an archaeological dig on one of the uncharted worlds in the Artemis Tau Cluster. Hmm. Now, we'll... Um, well, we'll start from the top and work down, so we'll start with Pharos. The colonists on Pharos might still be alive. It's your decision, Commander. You're a Spectre now. You don't answer to us. Your actions still reflect on humanity as a whole. You make a mess, and I get stuck cleaning it up. Well, we'll be careful. I'll try not to make things any harder on you, Ambassador. Glad to hear it, Commander. Remember, you were a human long before you were a Spectre. I have a meeting to get to. Captain Anderson can answer any questions you might have. Okay, let's have a little chat with the Cap. Yes, Commander. Hey, I want to know the truth about you and Saren. I want to know about the mission you were on together all those years ago. We had intel on a rogue scientist being funded by Batarian interests. He was trying to set up a facility to develop illegal AI technology out in the Verge. Alliance Intel had done all the work, but the Council wanted a Spectre involved. We compromised. I was assigned to help Saren in his investigation. We tracked the scientist to a refining facility on Kamala. He was hidden away somewhere inside, protected by an army of Batarian mercenaries. Mm, sounds fun. The plan was simple. Sneak into the plant, capture the scientist, sneak back out. Quick, quiet, and a minimum of bloodshed. Yeah, and some it went wrong. I'm guessing things didn't go as planned. 
Saren and I split up to cover more ground. Then about halfway through the mission, there was a massive explosion in the refinery core. <laughs> Officially, it was ruled an accident, but I think Saren detonated it on purpose to draw off the enemy guards. Was anyone hurt? Yeah, a lot of bloody people were hurt. So How many casualties? Me. The explosion tore the refinery to shreds. The whole place was on fire. Black chemical clouds poured out into the atmosphere. Nobody inside survived. There was a camp for the workers and their families nearby. Between the fires and the toxic fumes, the final death count was over 500. Mostly civilians. Saren didn't care. The target was eliminated. Mission accomplished. And I ended up taking the blame. That ended all talk of me joining the Spectre. Yeah, because that's how Saren wanted it. Saren caused the explosion. How'd he pin it on you? In his report, Saren accused me of blowing his cover. He said it was my fault the guards were ready for us. He claimed that's why it turned into a massacre. Saren's report was all the proof the Council needed to kill my chances of becoming a Spectre. Yeah, wasn't your don't fault. Don't blame yourself, Captain. I don't. I blame Saren. I think he wanted things to go bad. He was looking for an excuse to blow that refinery. Yep. Maybe he just likes the violence. Maybe he was just trying to make me look bad to keep humans out of the Spectres. If so, he pulled it off. Eh, Why'd you let him get away with it? Who do you think the Council was going to listen to? Me? Or their best agent? I had a bad feeling about him right from the start. I should have been more careful. Maybe I could have stopped things before they got out of hand. Yeah. Don't blame yourself, say. Captain. I don't. I blame Saren. I think oh, we've already had this. Come on. <clears throat> he was looking for an excuse to blow that refinery. Maybe he just likes the violence. Maybe he was just trying to make me look bad to keep humans out of the Spectres. If so, he pulled it off. Yeah, so fair. Well, but this doesn't matter anymore. The only thing I care about is stopping Saren. You're right, Commander. It's no good living in the past. Yeah, see if he's okay. How are you holding up? Honestly, this isn't how I pictured my career coming to an end. Pushing papers really isn't my thing. But you're the one who can stop Saren. I believe in you, Shepard. If that means I have to step aside, so be it. Oh, let's ask about Pharos. That's where we're going. Give me on our colony at Pharos. The entire planet used to be one giant protean city, mostly ruins now, but some of the infrastructure is still intact. The colony tried to build on what the Protheans left behind. We lost all contact with them when the Geth attacked. No, yeah, so that's about the other place we're going to, which is Novaria, first. What can you tell me about Novaria? Novaria's trouble. Always has been. The whole planet's basically a center for corporations to conduct illegal research. Watch your back there, Shepard. Spectres are about the only form of Citadel authority Novaria respects. But they aren't popular. And to uh, ask about the uh, cluster. What do you know about the Artemis Tau cluster? Not much. I've never been there myself. A handful of systems with a few small, uncharted worlds, but no real colonies. Might not be easy finding Dr. Tassoni out there. My advice is to look for the world with the Prothean ruins. Ah, okay, well, I'm I should go. Him. I'll be here if you need anything. All right, so I think, um... Oh, yes. Okay, we'll just scan the Keeper. <laughs> oh, there's Normandy. Hey, oh, that's how we get on board. All right, time to leave the Citadel and uh, get on. Knock, knock. Captain's here. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. Yeah, gotta have a good old decon. I heard what happened to Captain Anderson. Survives a hundred battles and then gets taken down by backroom politics. Just watch your back, Commander. If things go bad on this mission, you're next on their chopping block. Captain Anderson should be the one in charge. It's like I'm stealing the ship from him. Yeah, the captain got screwed. But it's not like you could have stopped it. Nobody's blaming you. Everyone on this ship's behind you, Commander. 100%. That's Intercom's good open. You got anything you want to say to the crew? Now's the time. Uh, let's be it. Uh, well, we need to be, let's be honest with them. 
This is Commander Shepard speaking. We have our orders. Find Saren before he finds the conduit. I won't lie to you, crew. This mission isn't going to be easy. Um. Well, let's go top, because top still seems to be Paragon, so I must do our For part. For too long, our species has stood apart from the others. Now it's time for us to step up and do our part for the rest of the galaxy. Time to show them what humans are made of. Need a prime this began stuff. with an attack on a human settlement in the Traverse. But we know Saren won't stop there. His Geth armies aren't going to stay on the far fringes of Citadel space. Oh, Saren will be Our enemy knows we're coming. When we go into the Traverse, Saren's followers will be waiting for us. But we'll be ready for them, too. Humanity needs to do this. Not just for our own sake, but for the sake of every other species in Citadel space. Saren must be stopped. And I promise you all, we will stop him. Well said, Commander. Captain will be proud. <laughs> we won't let him the down. Captain gave up everything so I could have this chance. We can't fail. Yes, sir. You just thought we had a good old uh Oh, let's have a little chat with Jacob. Commander, Jaker. something you need? Eh, yeah, well, it's a uh, fun about ship. Normandy performing? Is she everything they said she'd be? She's the best ship in the fleet. If you've got a pilot who knows how to handle her. Balance isn't what you'd expect. It takes a while to get used to that oversized drive core we got stuffed in the back, and her power can sneak up on you if you're not careful. The Normandy's probably too much ship for your average Alliance pilot, Commander. Lucky for you, I'm anything but average. Oh, no, we don't want to talk. All right, right. I have to go. Yep, we have to go because we want to get to wherever we're going. All right. Let's have a look at the journal because we got that. Oh, yeah, so we can do... Oh, so we've got all three of these because we said we're going to... Um... Yeah, so we've got Geth Interest, Geth Attack and Find... Well, I don't know. I think finding this one could be interesting. Um, I don't know. Well, we said we did, I did say Ferris earlier, so yeah, we're going to go to Ferris. <laughs> oh, all right. I think we have to use the uh, your map up here. Ooh, that's cool. Ooh. Okay, the Citadel. Supposedly constructed by the long extinct Prothians, this colossal deep space station, deep space station, deep space station, shall we, serves as the capital of the Citadel, of the Citadel Council. Gravity is simulated through the rotation and is a comfortable 1.02 standard G's on the walls and a light Point three standard G's on the Poseidon ring. Um, total length when open is 44.7 kilometers, and its diameter when open is 12.8 kilometers. So a small ship. A population of 13.2 million, not including keepers. Wow. And its gross weight is 7.11 billion metric tons. Wow. Definitely a small ship. Ooh. Wow, yeah. whoa, this is map is a bit. Wow, oh, well, you got to come right out. Wow. Oh, that's the Hawking place. Wow, we get to uh, really go nuts. Well, actually, there's one of Vera's in here, this one. Oh, that, that's to where the Sigma one is. Wow, we've got loads of places we can go and visit. Well, actually, change of plan. I know we said we we're going to go to Pharos. 
but Novaria seems to be the nearer one, so we'll, um... Well, no, so I really want to go and find... Actually, no, we'll go and find the, um, the chick. The, the, uh... Because I think... Something to tell... Something just in my gut is telling me, go here first, go here first. Okay, so we got a... Wow, so we've got a few places to go and visit. Oh, we've got a Sparta. Maceodon, I do believe. Athens. And Nosos. Oh, that's it. Oh, come on, this is so... This area is so Greek-based. Well, actually, let's go to Sparta first. Travel to another system. Um, yeah, she said it's from the Prothean Ruins, but we don't know much about this area, so... I want to go to Sparta first, so... Let's travel to Sparta. Mass Effect out of here. Ooh. Oh, now we've got planets we can go to. Wow. Well, that looks like the first. That's land. Have we got one that's on the third ring? Dunno. Oh, that's that. Ooh. Oh, I don't think they'll be on this one because this is a uh, a large hydrogen helium gas giant with traces of chlorine and sulfur. Ooh, lovely. Um, no, so we don't want to go with that one. Let's have a look at either. Commander, I'm picking up a signal from the planet's surface. It looks like an automated distress beacon. Hey, that sounds like this is where we could do. Um, terrestrial planet with an atmosphere of carbon dioxide and nitrogen. Uh, the surface is covered by wide, by wide deserts of, silic of silicate sand with only few areas of, in of igneous rock highlands. To break the abrasive dusk choked wind. Well, so we've got a distress beacon here, so um, let's go land. Okay, let's who we want to take on this one. Um, I don't know, because we've got me, so I've got combat strength. No, I kind of want to take something that's a bit... I think we'll take Rex. I kind of like him. So we'll take Rex and... Um, Hmm. I think we'll take Tali as well. On to uh let's have a go, let's go full alien and So we've got a bit of uh, everything that way. Repair for landing! Boom! Ooh! Have, we have gun. All oh, right, let's have a look at our map so we can. Um, oh, whoa! Rexy boy can uh, level up. So let's. Um, all right, let's. Uh, well, you, you got the old shield boost there. Still got three more points. Uh, we'll give them one more barrier. Buff up his uh, assault rifle, so we know he's got the shotguns, and we'll give him uh, one of the shotguns as well. Oh yeah. There we go. Um. No, we're not doing that one. 
Oh yeah, I think we started find that one, didn't we? Oh, looks like we're finding missing marines. Oh, so let's go and um, see if we can uh, find the recon team then. Okay, that's where the distress thing is, so we're going to be heading... So just something to turn around then and go behind us. Actually, the driving controls feel a little... Whoa! <laughs> whoa! <laughs> okay, Murphman, when going up hills, do not hit the boost button. <laughs> oh no, it's not boost button, it's a jump button, so we can actually, like, kind of jump. Whee! <laughs> Whoa, 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 what's that? Whoa, ow! Oh! Damn, looks like we, um, looks like we gotta keep moving. Yep, well, it looks like we found out what happened to those marines, though. Wow, definitely was not expecting that. Oh, what? Oh, no, it's just me all the way back here. Oh, hell no. Oh, please don't tell me. Oh, he just reloaded it back from where I say, for my last save. Oh, God, that is nuts. So, anyway, we're going to cut it here again, and I'm going to get back to where we were on the planet, at least. I'll um, rush through that all quick and get back to the planet, and we'll pick up in the next episode. Wow, that was an interesting one. I must remember, when we get to new planets, save straight away, because that way then we won't have to retrack anything. So if you like what you've seen today, smash that like button, show it some love, because you know you want to. And without further ado, I've been Ugaman83, so until next time, laters.